Hello and welcome to 5J Gaming. I'm 5J and let's play some Mega SG. First things first, I'm going to try a game I've never actually played before. I've played a lot of Aladdin on Super Nintendo, but never once on the Genesis. So let's check it out. There's a lot of reviews out there of the Mega SG, but what's better than just playing it? Hmm. That is some nice quality sound. I feel like I'm watching the movie. Sound effects or music? Wow, turn them off. It's terrible. What have I done? Oh boy. Uh, sword jump through. Okay, I think that's going to be okay. We'll <laughs> give it a shot. <laughs> I have no idea what the default controls are anymore. Genie bonus level. A boo bonus level. Extra health meter, okay, all right. Wow, this is already quite different from the Super Nintendo one. Ah, oh, they have more story involved. I like that. Some of the music. Mm. Genesis was really good at certain things, musically. Oh! Wow, we're gonna get little cutscenes. <laughs> That's quite a face. Does he have teeth in there? For one moment, I thought he was painting on an easel down there. The Agrabah Market. If I skipped anything, that's quite possible. I have a sword! Well, that definitely wasn't in the Nintendo version. Also, not in the movie. I'm really big on swords. <laughs> Hot foot. Take that! Oh, destroyed in a puff. Can I climb things? I feel like this song doesn't come till much later in the movie, but hey. It's okay. That looks very climbable. Is that a checkpoint? Why is he finding all these lamps already? Guy's taunting me? What a jerk. That's right. This is literally nothing like the Super Nintendo one. Not one bit. Interesting that they would develop two totally different games. Again, what's with all this genie stuff? He has not met the genie yet. Climb back up that way. You can still chuck apples, I mean, that's the same. But you can't jump on heads anymore, it seems. That's not a rope. Oh, I'm a sucker for all the apples. to go over him. I think I only have one hit left. I do not want to die. Whoa! Wait, did the apple kill him? That is not what the apples do in the other one. Oh, sweet! That is what it did. Alright then. Well, apples are infinitely more useful now. in a basket, tiptoeing around. Back off! Guess these guys just really don't want to eat their fruits and vegetables. Sorry. 
I'll keep that sort of dad joke to a minimum. Yeah, this this is not a great soundtrack right now. <laughs> Certain things, man, the Genesis just rip roars on. I need to get that. <clears throat> ha! He's pushing. Ah. There we go. What else is over there? There's a dude there. Oh, I hurt myself. There's fall damage. Okay, well that is also new. He's got something for me, right? It's a deal. Find more gems. Okay, well I bought an Aladdin head, whatever that does for me. I didn't memorize that little opening thing. I want to see what these little mini-games are. <laughs> like the way he's walking through the level. Uh, okay. Don't want to lose one, obviously. Of course. Of course. Pop goes the weasel? When was this in there? A boo in Agrabah. Do I get to steal a loaf of bread? Watch out, Abu! Yes, he has the sword! So... I'm not really doing much of anything. Just trying not to get hit by pots. Oh! That was cruel. Nice try. is approached by an ancient beggar. Ah, nice! I like the way they have the beard go outside the frame. Man, Jafar is real nasty looking. Super bald. Also, where are all these apples coming from? Pretty sure this region doesn't have a lot in the way of apple trees. Yeah, even camel spat. Hey, look, it's uh, Mickey Mouse ears. Wait. Yeah, and they have to. Yeah, the Disney movie. Duh. I was like, wait a minute. Yeah, no, we're good. And it's the, uh, snake from Robin Hood. At least so it would seem. It's getting all sorts of Disney stuff in here. So, that's kind of cool. You can, like, deflect the swords that they chuck at you. Ooh! Judging by how that looked, yeah, that would, that would really hurt. So Mickey's Mickey Mouse's ears are removable, huh? He's gotta wash them. Is he not a mouse? Is he just like a short little guy? Where's mouse hat? Where's a mouse hat? Just stuff in his face. Lucky guy. I'm poor. I can't even afford a loaf of bread. Oh, oh, that was death. There's be a lot of secrets in this game. I like that. Oh, 
Oh, chucking apples and empty swiping my sword. Hey, back off, pal. I thought there might be something down there. Looks like there's a golden scarab over here. Definitely don't want that. Hey. His feet are totally touching them. Hey, Iago! <laughs> How dare you. There we are. Ah. It's not exactly clear what you can and cannot stand on. It seems to kind of change. Which is strange. What's down there? Must have to come from the outside. Whoa! What happened there? Magic, of course. Thirteen, ten. What's a wish? Sure, but we bought the wish this time instead of, I guess, an extra life. It's probably what your head, your own head, means. How dare you! There it is. That's two halves of a scarab. Ooh. Ah, are there supposed to be bathrooms or something? Male and female signs there. Genies only. Good job, Boo. Wait. That's three halves of a scarab. Don't think that that's how it works. Just the... The two. All right, an apple. That's it, but what about the scarab pieces? Maybe all of those are equivalent to one, like, single side of the scarab, and you just need to collect one of them. Could be the case. Find the flutes. <laughs> oh, guess that's one. Hey! Whoa, magical rope there. I gotta say, so far, soundtrack goes to SNES. Much better soundtrack. Boy, I would like to get that. It flies away, but why can't I just grab it? Yeah, I was gonna say, you gotta take me somewhere new now, right? go and down Ooh. like the little coach genie helping you out there rubbing your shoulders round two so man I'm not exactly sure how I'm supposed to get to some of these secret areas how do I 
get that extra life. For one. I don't seem to jump any higher if I try to hit... Jump at the exact same time that I hit that. And there. Trying to go grab something that way doesn't seem to... Hit my head, but that's about it. Quite, man. Can't quite. How on earth would I get up there? Do 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 do. But it does make me want to watch Aladdin. I gotta give it that. Again, there's just loads of stuff that I don't have any idea how to get to. Hmm, sometimes there appears to be fall damage and other times there doesn't. So I'm a little bit confused exactly how it works. It's in the middle of the wall. How could I get there? Wow. We are finding a bunch of secrets. That much is happening. So the level is constructed differently than you might think. It's not as left to right oriented as the uh, Super Nintendo game is. That's very much go this way, then that way. Or, sorry, go this one way, and that's it. It's not easy. I would say it seems harder than the uh, Super Nintendo one. But it could just be that I've played that one a thousand times, and this one once. Oh, I see one thing there. Don't try to get it yet. Wow. You're certainly ready to attack. Can I jump above those things? Sure, don't seem to be able to. Ugh. Again, uh, I need to be using my sword more than those apples. Because that at least deflects some attacks. Like that. This game looks great and it plays great. And it's really looking good on this Mega SG. Not convinced I like this version more than the Super Nintendo one. I know I definitely don't like the soundtrack as much. Hands down. Magical flying ropes for no apparent reason. Ugh. Like skinning a Yago. Looks like he's ready for a Thanksgiving meal. Plucked instantly. 
Oh, is this a boss fight? This little guy? Too funny. Yeah, the first guy that you face is like the- in the Super Nintendo one is like the main Agrabah guard. You know, he's- no, 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 it's, uh, it's the merchant that, uh, is gonna chop off Jasmine's hand. That's right. Ah, oh, I can't believe that little shrimp got me. I gotta be getting low on lives now, that's kind of sad. But he's like right here. I also need to remember, I can deflect those knives. So I shouldn't really be afraid. So when I'm roll India like you're clearly doing. There we go. Sweet. And now what? Oh. All of a sudden that came out of nowhere. Oh. Oh. Interesting. I take it back! Alright, fine, go to the right. Whoa, playing a level of Donkey Kong now. Ouch. And I'm doing quite poorly at it. I like this, now you gotta fight this guy with apples. So, kind of like two bosses in this one. Back to back, I like that. Yeah, and he gives his little strut across the screen. Woo! I'd like to get out of Agrabah, though. I really don't care that I've lost that. The Sultan's Dungeon. Well, oh man, wait. Why am I in the dungeon? Oh, I guess I was thrown in jail. I guess you are in jail briefly before Jafar in disguise tells you how to get out. I can't quite jump high enough to that one. Let's do it the slow way. Oh, what? Ah. Oh. Bats, too, and this bat's a dumb one. Seriously, do you see me dropping through that platform? How do I jump on that? There we go. Man, really touchy landing hitbox there. So is this game significantly longer than the Super Nintendo one? Because that one is pretty short. It's short, but it's really good. I'm not convinced this one is really good yet. But it seems like it definitely won't be short. Ow. I like the back and forth swinging of those, uh... Yikes! Those, like, wrecking balls, whatever they're supposed to be, and what are they in a dungeon for? Maybe they're, um, the ball and chain, I suppose, but swinging from sort of mechanism for unknown reasons. Oh, I keep missing him. I still don't know what that wish did, so I'm just gonna buy an ex an, a couple of lives here. Since we were close to death anyway. Seems like a really good choice. Did you get up there? Just 
Just grab it. Oh, I see a genie thing. Not sure what it does, but... Hey! Ah! Oh! Man, I swear I was grabbing that thing, man. Well, at least we're close. Already bought those extra lives and put it to use. We would have got a, had a game over if we hadn't, so that worked out. This time I don't need that genie head. It's not worth it, man. It's gonna really stink if I miss that. Oh, like that? Oh, once again, missing the skeleton with a bomb. Where is that guy in the movie? These are very slow disappearing platforms. I'm very much used to Mega Man where it's very fast. Do you see me falling straight through a block that I clearly would have landed on in a normal game? Please stop. Thank goodness. Nope, nope. Whoa. There's like a little bit of like isometric to it. far enough away, but alas, I was not. Hope there's not like three levels in the dungeon like there were in Agrabah. So I'm ready to get into the end stage here. Slash move to the, uh... Man! Move into that uh, dungeon... The, the lion's head in the sand, where you get the flying carpet and the lamp. It is at least a little bit on the forgiving side. Oh, yes. Um, when it comes to when you time your jump off of it, that's at least nice. like that guy. Perfect. He taunts me, but then he wasn't ready when I got there. Overconfidence is his weakness. <laughs> that little end screen is just perfect, though. Yeah, I don't care. Please don't leave me in the dungeon again. The Cave of Wonder, that's what it's called. Thank you. Into the Cave of Wonders. Cave of Wonders is one of my favorite levels. Um, and the Super Nintendo one, so looking forward to seeing... Whoa, what this is like. I think I'm down to zero lives now, so gots to be careful. Oh. Oh. Okay then. Seriously. Uh, where is that little platform? There we go. I'm gonna say, um, yeah, I'd like to not die. That'd be great. You can't grab on ledges like you can in the Super Nintendo one. That's like the one 
ability I'm missing. Of course I do like where you can float with a parchment paper for absolutely no good reason. That's always fun too, but having a sword is pretty awesome. Oh! Thought it was one of those ones that would shoot you up. Nope. That's not how that one works. Oh, health, yay. Do only have one life, so I need as much of that as possible. Oof, that's annoying. <sighs> Run away. Does that heart have a little genie beard on it? A little goatee? I think it does. Oh, and a boo. Oh, it's not an extra life. I thought it was a Aladdin head. Very confused with that floating little guy is supposed to be, but, you know, whatever. No! Curse you, bat! Man, why are bats always the worst enemies? Seriously, come on! It's like invulnerable at only certain moments. Need that health. Yeah. And there it goes. Unfair, man. Can hit me when I can't hit it. Look at that. It's not until you go the other way. Yup, and that's the end of our lives. Ugh. Continue. Okay. Where does it start us from? Same level? Cause that'd be nice. Yeah, okay. I'm not really sure how much more of this we're, we're gonna play here. All I can say is it runs great, man. The Sega Mega Sega Mega, the Mega SG from Analog is working awesome. But not sure this is the best game ever to display for it. So I'm gonna play another one. So check out my next Let's Play video for the Mega SG.